Sweet. That should be a bit better. Uh, good morning and welcome to Irish Coffee. This morning we're going to be playing Fallout New Vegas for the Xbox 360. came out in 2010. Uh, wonderful little video game. You may have heard of it. There's a new one coming out. Uh, maybe this year. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. Um, but I spend the weekend playing this instead of playing uh, The Witcher or anything else. Uh, because I'm trying to complete it. So... Uh, I'm gonna jump right in. Uh, apologies if there's some dropped frames this morning. I don't know what's going on. It should be should be cool, uh, but if there is, uh, my apologies. Uh, but let's get right into it. So my save game should be right before the end. So who would name this one here? S Y S. This is the hard system save for when you basically go past the point of no return. So. Let's go past the point of no return. Um, so the point I'm at now for the story, folks, for those who remember anything about New Vegas, is I've killed Mr. House. Mr. Nice, or whatever the fuck his name is, is in charge. Um, I'm on pretty good terms with the NCR and the wildling dudes, whatever they're fucking called, uh, don't really like me. So <laughs> that's where I'm at. So... Committing to the fight at Hoover Dam. Is there anything you want to do before you enter the battle do now? Let's do this. Yes, man. That's his name. Yes, man. Sorry. Whoo. Yeah, I look cherry flavored. I spent all week in New Vegas and I've come out the other side looking looking pretty pinky. A week in LA um, next week for E3 is going to make it a lot worse as well. All right, here we go. Oh, look, all my friends are here. Rex is here, Veronica's here. How lovely. Hey, you got a second? Sure. What is it? The Brotherhood is failing. I've always known yeah, that. Yeah, that's true. But until recently, I haven't understood where we... Okay. I think I need to go. What? <laughs> you need to go? Um, why don't you go back on your own? Wow, don't everybody volunteer all at once <laughs> now? I could do that. You're not interested in coming along? All right, I'll go. Great. Thanks. Thank you. You're gonna hang around this time, though. You're gonna hang around with us. Cause you, your fists are really handy. Okay. Yeah. All right. She's got those big power gloves on, man. I don't wanna. I don't wanna ruin that. All right. So apparently there's a big battle that happens here. Oh shit! It's all kicking off already. Who are these guys? Jesus. Oh, great cons. Oh man. You guys, let me know if this is too loud. By the way, um, this is all gonna get a little bit weird. Oh yeah, that'll do it. So my shotgun perks are through the roof. I just leveled up. Uh, vilified. Oh, the great cons. Fuck that. I don't care about those guys. Um, I just um, got an extra perk for my shotgun just to just to really blow chunks out of people. So thanks as soon as ever in uh, in chat modding. Really appreciate it. Oh, here we go. When a bunch of them are together. I can't help but take out Annabelle. Hey, what's up, jerks? <laughs> one more, one more. I'm gonna Rex, get out of the way. You're gonna hurt yourself. <laughs> it's too much fun. Oh, great. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the. Uh, oh, Caesar's Legion don't like me anymore, but the NCR love me, so it's all going good. Um, I think that's... I, I have no idea what I want to happen at the end of this game. It's been too long since I have <laughs> like played it. Um, I played about two hours over the weekend, just trying to wrap all this up so I can complete it today. Um, where's the shotgun gone, man? Hunting shotgun? Is that what I was using? 93 DPS? Yeah, that's probably about right. Okay, watch, watch this. I want to watch her kick the shit. Yes! <laughs> Unpredictable. No one's sure what to make of your. Oh no! Did we kill an NCR guy? Did you just kill an NCR guy? Why did you do that? Is this guy? Oh no, Centurion. I guess they just think we're fucking crazy. Is Rex okay? Yeah, Rex is okay. All, right. All these guys are Centurions, so I don't know what's wrong with them. Oh fuck! More assholes. Okay. What should I do? Grenade, maybe? Incinerator? 
I do have this laser weapon. My laser weapon um, stats are so bad, though. Reload, reload, reload. <laughs> one more, one more. <laughs> I don't know how many of these guys there are. Maybe I shouldn't be wasting my, my, my grenade shots. Yeah. I love how she just goes over and punches everyone to death. Veronica, you are fucking rad. Rex, get up. You're, you're, you're not pulling your weight here. Uh, ooh, maximum carbine. I might actually use that. How much is the weigh? Six. I don't think I've got a decent assault rifle. I could do that and then just get rid of one of mine. Am I encumbered yet? I'm not? Okay, I'm alright. Alright, let's go. Uh, don't need that. Alright, let's keep moving, I guess. That's what the waypoint says. Dead man's dog. Legion, go home. There's some more than monster closet in the way out. You know, it's like, oh, Jesus Christ. Man, let's just get Veronica to do everything. <laughs> she just punches their heads off. <laughs> Leave some for me, girl. Oh, no. I'll do it. One more. Finish her off. Oh, Jesus Christ. I should probably stim up pretty soon. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Alright, you're gonna eat it. Whoa, alright. Remember Fallout? Remember Fallout? This is what Fallout. Yeah, there you go. Shit, shit. Stim, 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 stim. I probably have a crippled limb or two, do I? No, I'm okay. Let me stim up then. I don't really have that many stim packs, actually. I do have lots of doctor's bags, though. I think they're pretty solid. Um, let's take some jet. Am I not? Nuka Cola Victory. Ooh, that's pretty good. Yeah, why not? I got two of them. Let's hit it back. I have a feeling there's, there's no point in holding back at this stage of the game. Let's uh, duck behind this thing. I'm just waiting for Veronica to wake up, really. <laughs> Alright. You fuckers want a grenade? Is that what you fuckers want? Grenade launcher? No, I want to throw a grenade. Oh shit, he's a bit close. Yeah, hit that guy. God, I love this game so much. Oh, this fucking leg came off. Shit. I can't hit you with a grenade. Shotgun, 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 shotgun. I forget to do the, the one thing you're supposed to do in Fallout all the time as well, actually, which is, uh... Which is save every two seconds. Where the fuck is my... Here we are. All right. I'm gonna save right here, because why not? <laughs> oh, this guy's face is gonna eat it. Oh shit, I missed. It's a good thing I've taken all that jet. I've got more AP. Oh my god, you're kidding me. Fucking die. He'll blow his leg off. <laughs> this fucker. <laughs> my god. Where's Veronica? Get up, you fucking lazy... Shit. Shit. Alright, Maria. Get that hot Matthew Perry gun action.
58% chance on head. I'll take that. Oh, she fucking stunned away the pipe. Stay down. That'll do it. Veronica's unconscious again. Veronica's really letting the side down here. Incendiary grenade, that's pretty funny. Let's try that. Oh no, I should wait for more dudes for that one. Can I will the doctor's bag actually say um yeah, doctor's bag does everything, okay. Doctor's bag's pretty fucking great. Yeah, fuck you. Alright. Oh, no, I don't think I did my health, actually. Let's take some purified water. Rebound. Super stim pack. I only got one. I'll take one more stim. And then is there any more just food I can take? Any food? Any apples? Gumdrops? Sure, I don't care about rads. Medic's probably a good shout next time I get into a fight. Yeah, Doctor's Bag restores all body parts. Doesn't actually do anything else, I don't think. HP. Cat Eye. Oh, Buff Out gives me HP. Yeah, right. Get a little bit trippy. Okay, where are we supposed to go next? Oh, sec, sorry, chat. I'm not keeping a super close eye on you right now. I'm trying to complete Fallout. We going down here? We going down here? All right. The one thing I've noticed from playing this game for the first time in in years is that man the mini map and like like local map situation, world map and local map, it's just so fucking complicated to use. And the questing area. I mean it's probably a super good idea that they decided to um give you a new pit boy. No, I'm guessing we don't go up, I'm guessing we're going down. Right. That's the thing. I'm just kind of guessing. I don't actually know where I'm supposed to go. Uh, if you're wondering why it's so dark, it's just the game. <laughs> Alright, what we got down here? Are we supposed to be here? Isn't that the usual thing? You just leave somewhere and if the, if the waypoint points back at the door, you know you've gone in the wrong door. Uh, okay, apparently we're going this way. Open sesame! Hard save sesame. I don't know if I'm actually going to complete it today, but that's the point. Oh shit. You guys did a solid job. Stop right there. No one is allowed into the control room. You shouldn't be here. It's best if you just Really? Colonel Morrison Oh, who? See, this is the thing. I don't even know what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing now at this stage. <laughs> Goodbye. Sir. So is it telling me to go in there? Hoover Dam. Apparently. Alright. Get out of here already. Use my speech. Damn it all the hell. Let's go. Just thinking about it. What? Okay, fair enough. Yeah, my speech is a hundred, so I basically just speech my way through everything in this game. Activate. Oh, that's okay. So that's what I'm gonna do for Mr. House is is like turn on the dam or something. Okay, yeah. So Miss, oh, not Mr. House, Mr. Yes Man, Yes Man, Yes Man wanted me to go to the control room, Hoover Dam, install the override ship. Okay. So I guess I can do that. Hi. Nice to <laughs> this is probably a really bad idea. Oh man, oh man. Oh man. <laughs> I think this is just like the end of the... Hmm. So I don't really trust... 
<laughs> yes, man. <laughs> yeah, I love how everyone thinks this is Claptrap. I totally thought the same thing. I don't really trust Yes, man. But I kind of want to keep the fort. Like, the NCR are kind of fucked anyway if I go through with this. So I kind of want to see the army of Securitrons, if I'm being completely honest. <laughs> so, send power to the fort. Yes! This is going to be fun! <laughs> okay. I'm unlocking the east power plant. Hit the manual switch, then go topside and deal with the Legion and NCR. Okay. Alright, this sounds like a fun ending to the game. Yeah, killing Mr. House was something I wasn't really sure if I should do or not. I just didn't like him. <laughs> but when he when you take him out of that chamber and he's just a fucking old dude, I was like, oh man, this is... Oh shit, here we go. Let me turn it down here a little bit. Oh shit, did the NCR hit me now? Oh no, they don't. Hey, what's up? Better reload before I finish you off, motherfucker. Whoa, bugs. You guys my friends? You guys are my friends? <laughs> I think crippling someone's head is my favorite thing in this game. I just crippled your head. Come on, dudes. I got Veronica back. She's just punching the shit out of everyone. Alright, what well, am I supposed to do now? I'm supposed to flip a switch. Where's the switch? Switch this way? Oh, my jet wore off. Oh, hello, switch. Turn on switch. Exit the east side of the dam. I'm guessing that I won't see the Securitron until I go outside. Fingers crossed. Oh, this is exciting. This is exciting. Alright, I'm going to use my local map to figure out how to get the fuck out of here. It's up here, I guess. This is exciting, this is exciting! Is this the exit? Alright. Hopefully... I don't know, man. I don't know how big this thing's gonna be, how big this army's gonna be. Out here. Back outside. So I think at this stage all I want to do is kill all of Legion. But I don't know what happens to the NCR. Am I gonna have to fight my ass out of here? Okay, we're here. Where do I go? This way? Oh, have I popped up the other side? The other side of the barrier? I have, okay. I'm supposed to go this way. What the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shit, yeah. Are these the upgraded? <laughs> okay. Fair, fair enough. Rex just finished one off, so I got to watch that. Are these the upgraded Securitrons? I love how it says an army of Securitrons, and it's two of them. Or, like, it says, like, there's a whole legion of people coming, and it's three people. <laughs> like, there's nothing more to, to remind you of just how old this engine is than... <laughs> like there was a bit earlier where there was a president's speech and like they had like a big rousing like wah from the crowd and it was like 12 people oh yeah this is dope look at this shit look at this shit I don't even need to get involved <laughs> oh I have no ammo anyway I ran out of shotgun ammo which is actually not a good idea. I got this lever action shotgun though, that should hopefully. Oh, that'll do it. Thanks, Securitron Mark II. Do they have new faces? Oh, he killed him. Fuck you! <laughs> Ooh, I got more infamy. Alright. Who's next, Jokers? So this is a whole new part of the map I've not been to then, right? 
world map. Yeah, where am I going? The Legate's camp. Oh, I'm gonna kill that fuck. Maybe I have been here. I remember talking to that guy, but that was four years ago. So <laughs> I remember he was annoying. And seemed to have a weird appreciation for Roman history. Centurions. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with my shotgun. Maze. Ooh. Alright, boys, you coming with me or not? <laughs> Alright. Guess I'm going on my own. I love all this chat in the chat about different endings. I'm pretty happy with this ending. I'm. I'm pretty happy to be finally finishing this game. I literally, like, have never... I think this save on this... I think on PC, I had more. And then on this, I've got about... I think it's 50-something hours. But for whatever reason... I do the same in The Witcher. My problem is I just side quests all the time. So... I never... I just had this final mission, like, sitting on the side the whole time. I love Veronica so much. I think that's one of the best things about The Witcher is how they deliver you the main quests and you kind of, you feel compelled to, to do the story parts instead of this where I was just, I was so scared after Fallout 3. Like I, I dumped into Fallout 3 and completed it and that ending just like, when it when it, I wasn't able to play on, it was fucking devastating so, especially as I had Fox at the end. Come on. Fuck you. Alright, my health's not looking too good. Something tells me this isn't going to be the hardest ending. Buff out. I'm taking all that buff out. I'm gonna get addicted to buff out. Yeah, I got addicted to buff out. Whoops. <laughs> what else we got? Take some right away, actually. I think I need to. I think I've had too much. Stim pack. Oh no. That's not good. Oh good, Veronica just punched her head off. That's that's rad. Show me your head. I'll just watch them beat up my metal dog. <laughs> this ending is so much more different if you don't have Veronica. Veronica, I fucking love you. Alright. Why is <laughs> I knew it. I knew, I, should, I knew I should have kept you around. Alright, do I have to go up there? Is that his fucking main office behind all that corrugated iron? I keep thinking there's more of these seasons leading fucks lying around, but it's just it's just uh dummies for fighting with swords or something. Where am I going? Up here? Here we go. Here we go. End of the game. End of the main quest. Oh, look at this guy. He's gonna have a little chitter chat with me. You know what that means. <laughs> Compulsive amount of saving. An envoy of Vegas. Yet you carry yourself for battle. If so, uh -oh. you cannot truly be of that city of cowards. Hmm. If you think you've got any chance of taking Hoover Dam, you're wrong. Maybe we're meant to listen to reason. What if Caesar wasn't brave enough to come take the dam himself? I'm here to kill you. The Legion's Vance ends here. Nice mask. <laughs> Can't wait to wear it as a trophy. I kind of like that, but I'm going to go with this. I'm going to belittle Caesar. Kaiser's will is made truth through me. Oh, Kaiser. I am a hammer against all. If you seek to stand against... Maybe you want to listen to reason. I see you fight with words. Like all beneath... Speech. This battle is decided. That's why I'm here. Oh, yeah. I just love fucking speech in this game so much. So you see quarter, terms of surrender. Our no. roads into NCR are hung with the bodies of those who had save your speeches. Move forward. The Legion spent years trying to take the dam, take Hoover Dam. Hoover Dam has never seen the mass strength of the East. Only legged such as Graham. Oh, this is interesting. Who deserved the fire cut? Now I am here, 
and make markers of your people as the lead. And then what of the East? You speak in circles. What of the East? I. If you need all the East, if you need all the East to cross the West, the victory here shall be swift. Our forces shall take the dam, secure it, then build a road west on the bodies of the NCR. The East will hold. Once across the Colorado, nothing to rival who the huh. dam remains. Speech, it is not the strength of the West that will slow you, it is their weakness. Your weakness? You seek to thwart me by claiming the Legion is too strong for you? <laughs> the NCR's weakness is its size. It'll take your entire army to hold the West. This is fucking crazy. I'm so happy I have 100 speech. That does not mean we would not succeed. Oh my god, eventually, but... Moving your whole army west means losing the east. You can't hold both. The east was a hard-fought campaign. Even now, Kaisar drew too much of the Legion's blood needed there for this. Hoover Dam is but a place. I will not have it be the gravestone of the Legion. With a quick look. Fuck, which one? There's victory in wisdom, Legate. As for wisdom, there is wisdom in your words, man of the West. Have I just convinced no, them to I leave? Shall east. I shall not remain there forever. On that day, oh my God, what? Shall be tested. If the West is one day filled with ones such as you, perhaps it shall Ooh. be a worthy fight indeed. If you feel that war matters that much, perhaps you will see it differently in time. My coming would have saved you. Set your people free in ways they cannot see. I don't know, we probably would have worn oh, dorky headdresses. Broken the weak with its violence, yet allowing the strong to arise. Violence gave you that strength. Awakened you. I can see it upon your face. With two bullets left their mark. Perhaps it is unfortunate Wolpex was not here to hear your words. Something tells me you would prove more. Until the day when our armies meet again. I shall wait you on the battlefield. Holy shit. Hey, Veronica, don't worry. You don't have to punch that guy's face off. I just convinced him to take his entire army back west to Colorado. Or east. Or What a dumbass. God, that guy was a dumbass. <laughs> Did you not know I could do this, Danny? No, I didn't know I could convince him. Huh. I was kind of looking forward to wearing his mask as a face, to be completely honest. What's my next quest? Go back to fucking Watts' face? Jennifer Oliver and the NCR? Am I going to speech 100 that guy as well? Jesus. Yeah, Vulpez rather than Vulp... Yeah, it's... Isn't... Isn't... Kaza oh shit. What the fuck? Oh, NCR dudes, what's going on? Hey, don't worry about it, I convinced them to leave. Turns out I'm amazing at diplomat. <laughs> Caesar on the cross. Been a long time since I've seen the kind of work you've laid down today. A damn long time. Thanks, General Lee Oliver. And screams at those Legion bastards as they kick dirt running east like a choir of angels to my ears. Speaking of, that crazy light show over the fort? What the fuck was that? Some kind of thumb of God you called down? Amazing. <laughs> Fucking amazing. <laughs> Fucking amazing. Could use general curses a lot. Just scatter you over the east like jacks. Give me. Hold on that thought, General. I wanted to introduce you to some friends. Things that's great, you won't believe what happens next. Time to go to go. Uh, have you seen an entire army of upgraded security on General? <laughs> oh, this is fun. Hold on, so general. And, uh... Oh my god! Oh my god! Guess it ain't no secret how you, uh, I say, can you ask them to put their weapons down? I was just reaching in my coat to give you a cigar. General Oliver, Hoover Dam is ours. Leave at once. I suggest you leave before my boys open fire on your men. The dam is one for me. You and Legion have both lost today's security chant to raise NZO from this area. Oh my god. Oh my god, do I massacre them or fucking, or just let them, let them leave? 
The diamonds weren't for me yet. I would sooner spit on the grave of my dead mother than let some courier walk the wasteland. Fuck, talk to me like that. <laughs> Who the hell do you think you are? Looking, Looking to cash your cash chips down, answer your best. Are you sure that's wise? Retreat, we wiped about. Fuck, man, I just want to kill them. I just want to kill the NCR. Leave on your feet or le leave wrapped in your flag. Oh, burn them all. No survive. Yeah, f yeah. Fucking leave on your feet or leave. No, scary John's already sent you. Figured as much. Come on, you sons of. Let's do it. Fuck, he's gonna kill me. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> all right. All right. Let's try that again. Let's try that again. Except all I have to do this time is uh, <laughs> all I have to do this time is uh, is just run the fuck away as quickly as possible. Are oh, you kidding me? I got to do this shit again. All right. Watch, watch, watch me. Oh shit. Oops, 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 oops. There you go. Yeah, great. Great, took me two seconds to get rid of a, an entire... An, ent an entire war. Damn it, Danny, we told you to speech them. Should I speech this guy as well? I guess I could. Let me try. I like speeching them because then they tell me all their secrets. And I like hearing about their war secrets. I find their war secrets to be fascinating. Boom! That was the dynamite. Oh, heal up! Shit, good point. I forgot to heal straight away. All right. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna speech him through this time. Because this wouldn't be this wouldn't be a legitimate playtest of Fallout if we didn't save and change all of our decisions constantly. These are on the cross. Been a long time since I've. Hey, what's up, dudes? God, that's so cool. Yeah, you're right. I do need to no prepare my guns. All right. Cooper Divers eyes never once. I would sooner. Are you sure that's wise? Look, I know you're riding high right now, but let me tell you, you ain't. Oh my God, I'm on pissing me. on the bear. I'm pissing, pissing on the two-headed bear. You've been far enough west, I'm guessing, to know how far that claw stretches. Fuck with the bear and. How about I ask these robots to fuck you and the entire battalion with a rocket barrage? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, how am I not supposed to pick that? You want me to make tracks out of here? Head back west? Tail between our legs? No. I came for- Speech. Because you're talking and not attacking? Yeah. But I wasn't expecting a fight when I came up here. And now that we're talking- Yeah, you I don't, don't do generally. You little pussy. Know what you're doing? Making a nation like you think you're doing ain't like chowing down on a pile of fancy lad snack cakes. Lad snack. Think you got the guts to carve fancy out lad. Here, build. Can't do a worse job in the Republic, that's for sure. My sycophant tells me yes. <laughs> I like that. I guarantee I put more thought into the state of Mojave than you or anyone else here. <sighs> Hell. Can't believe yeah, like, I don't trust Yes Man at all. Job. I think he's just going to take over, Should and I kind of don't care. I just hate all you guys. I know what those robots of yours can do on a bad day, and I'm... But if you're taking this place, you better hope you can hold it. I'll give my superiors my opinion, but I don't think... Ooh. So if NCR comes at you, and it will. I see Yes Man. I see Yes Man, please, Sir General Oliver from the dam. Is Yes Man behind me? Oh no, I guess he's just all the things. Insults, is that all because I work to do? And so there's a much right here. Fuck, man. I guess I just have to kill him, right? Fine. Should I have let them go? Oh, God. I can... Up. Okay. You know what? I don't want to do this. I kind of want to throw a grenade at them and then see if the Securitrons attack. Let me see that. Hmm. 
What should I upgrade? See that speech? See that speech? 100, baby. 100. Lockpick? 100. I want to go with explosives up. Explosive and energy weapons are doing real poor. Let's get that up to 80, though. Yeah. Alright, watch this shit. Watch this shit. I don't know if this is going to work. Super job, oh, thanks. I didn't want to make a big deal about... I found some code snippets in one of Mr. House's data banks that will let Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Don't so do that. I don't want you to be more assertive. And it's going to take me a while, so it'll seem like I'm offline. I've updated the Securitron's targeting parameters, so they... Great. So that's where I'll be. Off making a few... We accomplished a lot. What? Oh, really? Fuck yeah, achievement. And so the courier who had cheated death in the cemetery Completed. outside... No Pittsburgh gods, no masters. ...cheated death. Once again, oh, Ron Perlman's the talking. Mojave Wasteland was forever changed. The courier, with the aid of Yes Man, drove both the Legion and the NCR from Hoover Dam, securing New Vegas's independence from both factions. With Mr. House out of the picture, part of the Securitron army was diverted to the Strip to keep order. Any chaos on the streets was ended. Quickly. Chaos became uncertainty, then acceptance with minimal loss of life. New Vegas assumed its position as an independent power in the Mojave. Supporting the ideals of independence, the courier was recognized as the man responsible for a truly free New Vegas. He ensured Mr. House's tyranny was broken, and neither Caesar's Legion nor NCR would ever gain control over New Vegas. Though some super mutants and Nightkin continued to journey to the legendary Utopitha, <laughs> they found little trace of its existence. Is that someone else's voice? Some eventually found their way to Jacobstown, but many wandered off into the wastes, confused and disheartened. Still grappling with self-doubt over his usefulness in the face of old age, Raoul was never able to find peace with himself. Aww. Eventually, he left the Mojave and assumed a new name as he had done so many times before. Though the wasteland became anarchic after Hoover Dam, the boomer's display of power dissuaded fortune seekers I've from forgotten about all of these side levels. quests. Hoping to lead the Mojave Brotherhood down a new path, Veronica sought to learn from the thriving cultures of the desert. Absent a firm solution, Veronica's expression of frustration with Brotherhood leadership would lead to her banishment. Oh. She ended her days a wandering tinker. Oh my god. Their leaders destroyed by the courier. The fiends scattered throughout the wasteland. Without the organization of Motor Runner, Cook Cook, Violet, and Driver Nephi, they were easy prey. After the courier ensured New Vegas remained free, the followers found that independent Vegas was even more unstable and violent than uh. before. Old Mormon Fort became excessively burdened by the influx of patients, struggling to provide even the most basic of services. With New Vegas's independence formally declared, Good Springs thrived. Yeah. More travelers stopped by Good Springs on their way to and from the Strip, and the locals grew prosperous from the traffic. Awesome. Thanks to the courier and Lily, a cure for the Nightkin schizophrenia was found shortly after Dr. Henry's experiment yeah. concluded. Nightkin and other super mutants in the wasteland flocked to Jacobstown, and the town became known as a haven where a mutant could find peace. Lily continued to take her medicine at half doses. And although she remembered her grandchildren, her mind remained muddled and confused. Eventually, she parted ways with the courier and traveled west, seeking the remnants of her. That quest was so good. The kings retained their control of Freeside, and while they continued to favor uh -huh. the needs of locals, they tolerated the citizens of the defeated NCR. Revitalized by Violetta's brain, Rex eventually learned to balance the memories of his old life with Violetta's experiences among the brutal fiends. Aww. His mind had difficulty adjusting, but Rex eventually found peace with his new, more vicious self. Shaped up by the courier's advice, wow. the misfits distinguished themselves during the Legion's attack on oh, Camp Golf. Mags was finally promoted to sergeant, and the rest of the misfits received an official commendation. Cool. They continued to serve with distinction for many years. Though Novak was a low-priority target for the Legion, many of Novak's citizens died in its defense. 
In the weeks that followed, several bright followers returned to Novak to help restore its defenses, allowing it to remain independent of NCR. After Hoover Jesus, Daniel, I didn't realize they did all this stuff. powder gangers at the correctional facility vanished into the waste, leaving the prison game. empty. The correctional facility became another abandoned ruin in the wasteland, its carcass occasionally picked over by enterprising prospectors. Armed with a wide array of improvised explosives and stolen <laughs> weapons, that guy? the Vault 19 powder gang tormented this, the Mojave wasteland for Is this the gathering? Citizens of the NCR were favorite targets. And they always suffer that guy on the left states. became the new drummer for Slipknot. Despite NCR's pledge to support Prim, they abandoned the town after their loss to the Courier. <laughs> Independent again, Prim operates much as it had before the powder gangs arrived, full of ups and downs. And so the Courier's road came to an end, for now. <gasps> In the new world of the Mojave Wasteland, fighting continued, blood was spilled. And many lived and died just as they had in the old world. Because war, war never changes. Bam! Drop the mic, Hellboy. Well, there you go. I finally completed Fallout New Vegas <laughs> five years later. Um. Fuck, man. All right, I'm gonna go back to. Oh, we, should, we straight up have a credit situation happening here. Jesus, I think the best ending is probably the Mister House one. I think it's the one that's probably the has the most. I don't know. I just don't like an autocratic dictator situation. It makes me feel uncomfortable. Congratulations, I completed Fallout New Vegas. Would you like to load a save prior to the Hoover Dam battle? If so, if you select no, you return to the main menu. <clears throat> so you straight up can play on. That's crazy. Yeah, go on. Let's load a save game. Fuck, man. I think we are totally gone past the days of um, main quests ending the game in open world RPGs. Like in... It's almost like... no. Yeah, not ready yet. See you later, guys, man. Um Yeah, I think I think we're we're well past that. It's just like the, there has been too many I guess um demonstrations of how good or how effective you can make a story by n not having it finish and I also think that there's there's this kind of um sorry, my fucking words in the morning are real bad. Um there's this kind of reaction to uh, all games having this like hero complex thing where like your character is the most important part of this wider society like even Skyrim didn't you know you were I guess you were dragonborn you were doing all that shit but like kind of life continued on anyway and in The Witcher you're definitely like a important character in the world but ultimately what happens in the battles and the wider world isn't really your responsibility what is going on here Video games, video games, video games, la la la, this is real dumb. All right, let's go for a wander. Let's find somewhere to hit up. Jesus Christ. Seen a lot of stuff. I've been a lot of places, seen a lot of stuff. Jacobstown. Where's there a spot where we haven't seen anything? Brooks Tumbleweed Ranch. The Nellis Array. Ooh, I think I have a quest around there. Repair the broken solar array panels. Is that a fun one? Doesn't sound very fun. It is at Nellis. I thought so. Alright, let's go to Nellis. I'm gonna go to Nellis and then head east and see if there's anything there. Because we're not up, we've still got another 10 minutes left on Irish coffee this morning. Uh, it's gonna be a fun week on GameSpot this week, actually. We've got uh, all the UK and AU folks in... Um, so, mm. so tomorrow's lobby is going to have Lucy James, Jess McDonald, Tamar Hussein, Rob Crossley, Dan Hines. Um, and Zorin didn't put her name down, but I'll see if I can get her on as well. Yeah, my favorite thing, if you remember from last week when I played Fallout, was just picking a random spot and heading there. So let's head there. 
if I can head there. Because uh, I've clearly got a really full map at the moment. Maybe too full. And I like I like getting lost. But you can never tell in this game when you reach the edge of the map. Until you just hit it and it's like... Wah, wah. Can't go further than here, buddy. Something tells me that this big old fence is probably the edge of the map. But like any fence in Fallout New Vegas, you can walk around it. Is that a Securitron or a plant? I wonder if I always wondered did they do this on purpose. From a distance, these plants always reminded me of Securitron, so I spent half the time wondering <laughs> from a distance. See in there, look at them, look at that guy there right in front of us. It looks like a Securitron, the little or sorry, Protectotron. The one with the little uh, little glass bobble heads on them. But it's not. It's a fucking succulent or cactus or some shit. I just want something to kill, man. I guess I could just kill all the people in New Vegas. If I don't find anything, I'll do that. Ooh, can I jump over here? The other thing about this, about playing Fallout, which I guess I didn't appreciate after being a couple of years from playing it, is just how mechanical the quests are. Like, the conversation I had with... The fact that it says Speech 100. Like, the fact that you can just kind of pick your way, you can game your way through each quest. And it doesn't feel like it's... Like, it just feels like a spreadsheet, I guess. I Like, I had that quest with the that weird little gang, that army gang, the misfits who I needed to, like, perk them up so that the the faction would, would allow me to send some army people to a different part of the world. Um... Oh, I love these Mr. Gutsies. These are the Mr. Handies that have been retrofitted for army use. I'm amazed that an outsider has proven so helpful. What's up? Um, yeah, and I just kind of walked, went around and hit all the speech things. And I, one of the, one, I went to talk to one of them and he was like, this is my idea. And I was like, do you want to continue with this idea? Or do you want to consider some other ideas from other players? So I went around and considered their ideas. And I was like, oh, let me come back to you and like see if I like your idea the most. Like It just felt a bit... It felt like they were really telegraphing the decisions, which I guess is an important part of making an RPG, but it's also kind of makes it a little bit less believable as a world. I'm getting out of here. Whoa, sweet gate. Um, yeah, so it felt a little bit like, oh yeah, I forgot that RPGs could be this way. Man, I remember the first time we saw the lights of New Vegas in this game. I think that's what I'm most looking forward to, is, is loading into a game and seeing like this, but empty. And knowing, like, all the possibilities. Like, you get such a rush off that. I'm still in that place with, with The Witcher. I keep wandering into new towns and finding new... Uh, ...adventures and journeys. I will be honest, I am very... From playing this and playing Fallout 3, I'm very tempted to start over. I don't know which one, though. I think maybe Fallout 3. I know there's a bunch of references to... ...Boston in this one, but... You know what? I'm I'm not close enough to anything. Let's go somewhere else. There's too much army shit happening over there. What about? Oh, they don't like me in Sloan. Fuck Sloan. <laughs> Back to Goodspring. Vilified. Powder Gang Camp West. I wonder if they're still there. I wonder if there's any Powder Gangers left for me to use my. I think I've got a fat boy with one shot in it, actually. I might just do that. <laughs> Speech 100, that case. <laughs> Good shout. Mosh kitty. Um, stream the playthrough. Yeah, I probably could. I mean, summer's coming up. There's not really much in the way of games. Alright, Powder Gang, where you at? I think I killed all you fucks. That was a really cool quest. I like Years later, I still remember this. Were they down there? Is that where they were? Inside the prison, maybe? Pedagon Camp South. Yeah, I think I'm vilified because I murdered them all. <laughs> is 
in Good Springs, just around the corner from here. It's just up the road. Yeah, it's just up there. We'll go back to Good Springs. Check in on everyone. What's that over there? What's that? There's something moving. What are you? Oh, it's one of those fucking geckos. Come here. <laughs> Come here, you gecko fuck. Really, there's only one way to kill a gecko. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, jeez, what's going on over there? There's a whole fight. I didn't want Maria. I wanted the other lady name. Where is it? Annabelle. Keep getting my lady name weapons mixed up. Hey, gecko. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do it. Any more geckos? Oh, bloatfly. I want to be real good to pick that bloatfly out of the air. Alright, you know what? I'm going to go back and kill everyone in Good Springs. That'll be the end. I feel like what better way to finish. Really, the only thing I wanted to change about my completion of Fallout New Vegas was that everyone in Good Springs was dead as well. Or oh, they probably all just go unconscious. Yeah, Red Dead Story was great, actually. If you want to talk about f finishing the game or the game continuing after you, you finish it. Oh, fucking rad scorpions. Did I kill them all? Nope, sure didn't. Alright, whatever. Oh, hi, Good Springs. What's going on? How y'all doing? Do I have any? I hear somebody saying punch them all to death. I'm not sure if I actually have Wizard of Video Games on. Uh, I'm not sure if I actually have any. Any good punching dynamite plasma grenade service rifle spiked knuckles is all I got sadly oh I don't have the fat boy Rex has the fat boy that's where it is Rex is carrying around the fat boy and a different flamethrower but he's back at Mr. House's place at the moment as of this playthrough I have him like guarding the bottom of the elevator for some reason hey good springs Oh, I could kill that young bighorner. I want human prey. There's too many young bighorners. <laughs> Great. Hey, what's going on? Big Horner hate me now. Kaboom! I could get an achievement if I kill a bunch of people with this here rocket. Man, Good Springs aren't very happy with me. Maybe some sort of multi-pass? Multi-pass rifle? <laughs> multi-pass. Oh, this fucking thing. I remember this. I bet this sucks when you get hit by it. Come here, come here. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where's he running? Is he here? He inside the building? Can I shoot you inside your own home? Man, loading inside of buildings, that's something we're not gonna miss. Wild child. Your wild, seemingly capricious behavior leaves people scratching their heads in confusion and avoiding close contact. Hey, Sonny. Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? Mm, just until you're all dead. Oh, that's it. oh, I'm sorry, little dog. And hello, Good Springs settler. I'll shoot you in the head. Boo! <laughs> Game is so fucking dark. Alright, how about 
How about we just throw a grenade in there? Or a mine? Or long fuse dynamite? Uh, I don't want it to be too long fuse. I want it to blow. I want to see it blow up. I killed a dog? Nope. There you go, that'll do it. He's got no legs now. Sonny, stop it. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, this game is just the worst. <laughs> oh my lord. Uh, okay. <laughs> There's something about the way people die in this game that is so fucking disgusting. I'm really crippled. My leg is real crippled. Hey, Big Horner. Don't mind me, guys. Don't mind me. <laughs> uh, let's head up to the saloon. See if anyone's there. I need to fix my leg. It's going to take forever really, otherwise. Doctor's bag. Stim pack. Stim pack. Stim pack. Good as new. Stim pack. Alright, see what's going on in the saloon, shall we? In the saloon. I think my grenade launcher is my favorite weapon. Hasn't got that much distance. This bighorn would really want to learn about grenade launchers. <laughs> um, I wonder if I killed everyone here and then completed the game, would it say, instead of saying that... This town, Good Springs, became prosperous. It would say that everyone passed it because everyone there was dead, including all the big horners. Oh my lord. Let's see who's in here. Anyone? Anyone? Hey guys. Hey guys, anyone want to play some pool? Are you all cowering in the back? See, like. In a weird way, this game is way more vicious and disgusting and, like, visceral when you kill random people, survivors, than even, like, hatred is. <laughs> like, they just did such a good job in this of making the violence so, like, unrepentant and, like, it just applies to everyone. Like, it doesn't matter if you're good or bad or whatever. You can blow just this innocent little girl's face off with a grenade launcher in her own kitchen <laughs> or she could be somebody you help and talk to over the course of the game or you can just blow her face off I think that's it I think my blowing face offs uh, are done let me see if there's one more one more one more victim oh, you know what I could do actually is just fucking continue the, the death parade and head over to Novak there's no back yeah, it's over here, right? Ooh, of all 11th right there. Novak, yeah. They like me in Novak. Not for long. Alright. Find Doc Mitchell. <laughs> I'm gonna find whoever owns that Dinky the Dinosaur finish them off. Oh, Novak, you're not gonna like me. Oh, is that him? Oh my god, it's Manny Vargas. What's up, Manny? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, soft-hearted devil. I think I'm... My heart's pretty cold, guys. I don't know. Alright. Alright. I think my bloodlust has been... Um, placated for, for another day. Uh, that's uh, that's Irish Coffee for today. Thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, if you missed any of today's stream, it's all available on YouTube.com forward slash Daniel Dwyer. Um, it's pre-three week. Uh, on the lobby this week, we've got a bunch of chats about uh, what we think is going to happen at various conferences. Um, no episode at a point this week. 
and um, we'll have an alt f1 and i'm recording a dancers as well um but uh yeah apart from that i don't suspect we'll see much in the way of leaks news and stuff until the end of the week um and then i'm heading down on saturday to uh, e3 in la uh, i'm driving there with jeff i'm not sure if anyone else is coming at the moment so it might just be the two of us talking for seven hours um and we're heading down saturday so we'll be there during but there's this big blowout because we most of our team for GameSpot wasn't actually going to go down until sunday but i didn't want to be in the air or in a car when um all the fallout stuff was happening so i'm going to be there early sunday morning waking up and looking forward to uh, e Fallout 4 day before all the E3 nonsense happens, and I'm sure you are too. Uh, if you missed it, there was an episode of The Point all about um, some of the rumors uh, that I think, or some of the things that I think the Fallout 4 trailer is trying to tell us, especially about the different timelines and whether or not the 2077 stuff will be playable. Um, so you can check that out on YouTube if you want as well. Otherwise, I will see you guys later. Uh, don't know what I'm going to play on Friday. Uh, open to all suggestions as ever at Daniel Dwyer on Twitter. Uh, but otherwise, I'm going to go to work. Have a good day. Don't kill anyone.